right. Let's go down and... Oh, wow. I just slid down a... I just slid down some weird bloody stuff. Oh, this is that crushy room that we just passed. So we just have one more pathway, and then we got the flamey, shimmy, red barrel things. All right. That's a little hard to aim here, guys. A little hard to aim. Hold on. Sit still. Oh, this isn't hard. I thought this would be a lot. This looked like a lot more daunting of a room than it really was. Daunting, just another word for determination, baby. But yeah, it's um, you know, just to match all that uh, pure gameplay that we just did. Um, you know, it's getting kind of scary. I probably have, I don't know, about. I don't know. Ten more, ten more nights at my um, at my uh, place of origin, my house, until I move out on my own with uh, Kelly into an apartment. And it's gonna be great. I'm really excited, and I don't think I'm gonna feel homesick from that because I mean, I have Kelly with me, and I, it's, I'm ready to. Um, but you know, I love my parents, and it's gonna be weird because it's it's gonna. And I think it might be weird for them, and they're not not telling me, but. Um, you know, they're being very supportive. They offered to, you know, purchase me like a, you know, like a coffee table or something if I needed or something. So, you know, I can't be, I can't be any more grateful than the parents I have. You know, I love them both dearly. Um, I'm sure that's what you've been wanting in a Shadow Manic Let's Play is someone being gushy about loving their parents. But, uh, you know, shit dick. Oh, we matched that with perfect cursing. That's for, yes. There was like 20 million Gobi in this room, and I am completely okay with this. And it looks like you can't do a little cheat jump, can you? Because they turn around too quick. Son of a bitch. Um, but... Oh! Hey, I, oh, I opened one. But, you know... The one thing is scary is that I'm used to getting, you know, gaining some profit on each of my, on e every month. But this time, now that I live and I have to pay rent and bills and renter's insurance and a parking um, per month, you know, it's uh, hey, nice. That how's it get to one Govia, I guess. Um, it's a little daunting because that's why I, now you know where that came from. Why I said daunting. Um, that you know, I have to kind of. Learned that I'm not going to have as much money as I was used to. And, you know, like, a couple games that have come out that I kind of want, I'm just not going to buy them until they're actually on sale. I mean, you know, I kind of feel more adult that way. Uh, yeah, you could say I'm adult. I'm 23. But, you know, at this day and age, I think being 23 is pretty good for, for getting out of here. All right, that is going to be one quick climb that we're going to have to do to get to beat this guy. This is going to be pretty tough. Just don't squish my face. Oh, God. Go! Go! You know, I, I'm going to be lucky to see, like, a few, just a, just a very marginal amount of profit, and that's me working overtime, but I've already gotten to the swing of working overtime. Instead of coming in my normal shift is 7, 7 in the morning until 3.30 p.m. That's a normal, my normal shift. I never work that. Um, what I'm doing now, my my revised shift, my uh, bloody shift, if you will, is... Um, <laughs> it's uh, 6 a.m. to 4.30 p.m. But uh, once in a while, you know, it's 6, 6 in the morning to, like, I don't know, uh, 4 or 3.30, because I like, I'd rather go early and leave at a regular time than go, go at the right time and then leave late, you know, I'd rather have my day, my evening than my morning, because morning I'm, I'm, I'm pretty much a zombie anyway, so I must be a zombie at work and not when I want to have fun, you know, good way to think about it, not that, I don't think my boss would want to hear that, but, <laughs> gotten used to drinking coffee, I tell you that, my, the president there drinks, uh, some pretty fancy coffee, and I've actually got lucky, I get like, a. Blue Mountain Jamaican Colombian whole bean coffee that you grind freshly and stuff. It's he's all about it, and he buys the coffee because you know he's the president. He can afford buying the coffee, and um, so I actually drink a cup. Of, I drink about a cup every day 
for the work. Well, for five days a week. And really, I heard somewhere, and I'm pretty sure it's right, that uh, drinking uh, one cup a day is uh, actually pretty healthy for you. It's it's not it's not unhealthy. So you know. There we go. Now you can't climb up there, so that was actually intense. So, uh, zoom! Alright, so we got over there. Quick save. And really, quick save is no different. You can save any time on the N64 version, but, you know, quick save is just easier to do than push start and save. I like so. That's what I love about that PC. You can quick save. And no, like I said, it's not an easy thing. Oh, this is a cool looking uh, Gobi. There's a Gobi over there too. Gobi everywhere, baby. I like this. Instead of a, instead of trying to find new areas and like find items, it's just about hunting down Gobi now. It's kind of neat. Really fucking cool, man. Really cool. Although, actually, I could get. Uh, how can we do this? Can we kind of make this jump like this? Yes, we can. Yes, we can. You just keep controlling that little uh, circuit board there, buddy. Don't worry about me. Don't worry about the Shadow Man. The Shadow Man is going to claw your face in. Here it comes, baby. Ready for it? Boom! And a boom! Sit down! Boosh! Whoa! What? What was that? Whoops. Can't do that, huh? Bam! Man, we'll have eight blocks in no time, baby. We're just collecting them left and right. I can't be any more happy about it, really. It's really nice. So I think I avoided this entire bullshit room by just jumping for that. And it doesn't look like there's anything down there. Except horrible death. Yep. Looks like just horrible death. And I can't believe there's no map in this game. That is really kind of like... You gotta. It's, it actually kind of makes the game a bit hardcore. You gotta really just have to remember. If you got a bad memory, I'm sorry. You're kind of fucked, buddy. So. Okay. See that's. Oh no no no! Don't do that! Don't do that! Okay. Oh good. This went full circle then. Well then we can grab this cato here. So really, that's I guess that flame down there is to punish you. But we got everything. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, we just went every direction in here. And what do we have in the pathways, actually? 10 out of 11, we're missing one, and... Um... Boy, I'd love to check where that would that one would be, guys, but I, I... Oh no, it's probably the bongo, it might be in the bongo area. And if it's not, well, we'll, we'll find it, we'll find it eventually. Did I ever go? No, that leads to the engine block, right? Seven here? Yep, seven. Interesting. So we got seven here, we got two in the area that was just in with the baton, and then one in, I think, in the beginning of the engine block room. Or somewhere. Or no, in the beginning of Temple of Prophecy. So let's see where this leads. Oh my. Oh, what? It's a shortcut. That is lame as hell. I don't really appreciate that game. That was extremely, um... I was unhappy. That was, that was a... That's a sad bladdy right there. That's a that's a sad bladdy. I didn't like that one. Nope. That's that's all you, game. So there's a seven block right there, and there's a, there's a seven block right there only. Because we have... Yeah, seven. But uh, before we do that, let us check on... Uh, over here. Over here is where there's a seven blocker, I believe. And then there's one up there, and that's it. Because I just ruined the other seven block by just being a shortcut, which is bullcrap. I might die from these guys. Bam, 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 bam! Uh-oh, this is in trouble. Oh, a weapon. 
Another part of the Eclipser? This should be useful. This might be the part of the Eclipser. The Eclipser, La Loom. We have three of them. She said just find other the other two parts, even though I think there's five according to that prophecy. Well, let's no, waste no time and let's see. We might be able to get some vengeance on For We Are Many, Pilgrim! Okay, Nettie, I've got me all three pieces of Leclipse. So work your voodoo magic and bring on the night. Sounds like a cue for a song, but this ain't no musical. Give me the blade. Lay down, Mike. I thought you'd never ask. Is, uh, this gonna hurt much? <laughs> yes. I thought so. Try and be gentle with me. Bringer of night, like Lipsar, release the shadow into the world of men. Le soleil, brother son, la lune, sister moon, la lamb, the power that binds. And the sorceress fell into a deep trance, her powers exhausted, and a shadow did fall upon the world of men. The prophecy is fulfilled. Agneta! It is done. Seek out the five. Destroy them and the evil that controls them. I must sleep. Must sleep. Wow, that's just intense. Well, let's collect our dark souls in life, life side. Our dark souls are mine. Wow, man. Ugh. It's not that I'm emotionally attached to Nettie, it's just, like, such a ritual that had just happened. It's just weird. Is it gonna be dark outside? Is there gonna be beasts out here? Yep! Oh shit, oh, shit is right! They're strong! Oh, they get back up! Oh, they get back up! Time to run! Alright, 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 um, 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 okay. Shotgun shells? See, wait, can we use shotgun shells in here too? We can! Interesting. I can use my, even though, cause since it's live side, even though I'm Shadow Man, I can still use... Very interesting. But before we use that baton as much as I want to, let's quickly head back and grab the goby that we know that are there. This just, man, I feel like I'm at the end of the game, but I'm not. But in reality, I could fight the bosses. And I'm going to, trust me. Oh, that baton leads there, so I should have done that. Oh well, whatever. No, pr no problem. Got it. Oh god. Actually, this might be the only place there is a Gobi. 
For some reason, I'm propelled to go back the whole way. There might be something here. Although, I gotta admit, it's kinda dangerous. No, there is a Gobi back here. I know there is. I remember. It's the very first Gobi you see in the game. Yeah, these zombies get back up. These are zombie dogs through and through. They get right back up. Here we go. Yeah. Gotcha. Oh my god, I'm gonna die. Run! First of all, they take three charged up seven blocks. Second of all, they get up. Oh, man. And here we go, the beginning of the game. Nothing. Nothing at all. Let's, let's just, let's just... Ooh, look at that. It looks yucky now. Well, there's five more Dark Souls. I know where maybe, actually, all of them are. I hope those alligators don't turn into zombies. Oh, now we got the music back. Suddenly feels a little bit less, uh... Creepy. Oh well. Alright, let's get that baton out and let's get the hell out of here. Now! Get out of here! Alright! Nice! Don't mind if I do, baby. Alright, Shadowman, what are you gonna do? We're gonna run really freaking quick. Holy shit! Oh, 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 oh. Ooh. Excuse me, excuse me, excuse me, excuse me, excuse me, danger! Holy crap, remember this guy? It's the very beginning of the game? No longer. No longer. We are much farther than that. But we're on a search for Govi and nothing else. And now we have a limited breath, so we can go maybe down farther down in places. Aha! Nice. So, I was about to say, what was the point of the shotgun and stuff? So we never need to be Mikey again. Which is actually kind of sad. Ooh, is this secret? Did I go this way before? I don't know, did I? I'm not exactly positive where I am. Um... Oh, wait, this is the way we want to go. Yeah, there's a Gobi over here. So strange we're back here again. But there's the eclipse. So so get, apparently it just has to be nighttime for you to be Shadow Man, which makes sense because beginning in cutscene during the nighttime, you're there. But this forces nighttime during the daytime. Bullets. Okay. Gobi. Okay. Nice. We've got plenty of places to check here. Oh god! Oh god, I got one hit point. Don't forget that. Uh, I think there's another Gobi. I think there's another Gobi. Need hit points. Run! This is intense, man. Yep, I hear one. Wait, where's it at? Wait, I hear it. I hear it, but don't see it. Oh, how the fuck do you get up there? Not up, not that way. Good, they can't come down. Okay, let's look here. Oh god. How do you get that? Seriously, I don't know how you get that. Interesting. I am the lover of crocodiles. Just let me get this Gobi in here. Nice. Roll the way to the beginning of the first part of the episode. 
Man, we're getting played. We're gonna get to eight in no time. Although, really, eight only gives you one area, one coffin block. So, we've got to really hope that coffin block is a good one. Oh, God, he's directing towards me. Yeah, he's trying to bend towards me. I see you. I see you. Excuse me. Excuse me. Pardon me. Get out of the way, man. Oh, the music's a little menacing, isn't it? But we're back here. Now I gotta figure out how to get to that Govi. Okay, this is where I remembered. I knew there was another seven gate, so there's only uh, the only other seven gate left is this one and the one at the top of that place where there's an eight and nine. So that's pretty crazy that we found we got a lot of Dark Souls in, in the live side though. I think that last one we might need the Calabash for. Cause that's I think I searched that place completely. It's not that big of an area. Oh, we need bongos. But look, there's an item down here. This should be useful. Uh, can't even tell what the hell that is. A cane? Maratu is the drama. What weird. Interesting. Whoa. That must be an order. Interesting. Huh. All right, well, we know where to go with drums. We've got a couple places, man. Well, hello, guys. How are you guys doing? Jesus. We'll, we'll, we'll search for drums um, next time.